Hello YouTube. It is another beautiful morning here. About 50 or so degrees out in uh, the Phoenix area. And I'm loving it. It's almost perfect riding weather. Anyway, this is the uh, introductory video and I'd like to take a chance to welcome you to my channel. Uh, Two Go Full Talk is going to be uh, kind of a combination of a couple of channels out there, their channel styles and topics that I've really come to enjoy over the last couple of years. Uh, first of all, as you can tell, I ride a motorcycle and um, I kind of want to just share my thoughts as I ride along and uh, more importantly, I'm going to bring you guys along as I help build and develop a photography business with myself and a couple of partners. So we've been operating for uh, a couple of years and we're doing okay. We're making uh, some inroads into the motorsport community and doing some portraits every now and again. But one of the things I really found missing that's uh, from the existing content is how do you do this kind of stuff and how do you take good photos and how do you build a business but on a budget I mean everybody loves going out and checking the reviews of you know the new mirrorless systems that dropped and you know one of my partners has a EOS R and it's a fantastic camera but not everybody who's starting out and trying to build a business has the couple of grand to drop on the latest equipment and what we want to cover is how do we do how do we do this? How do we build a brand and a business and provide a good service while maintaining, you know, kind of a cost-effective model? It doesn't really make sense to drop all of your income on new gear and kind of defeats the purpose of having a business. So that's what we're doing. Uh, in addition to that, you get the added benefit of me trying to fit everything I need for this business on the back of a motorcycle, which means no big, heavy, lighting systems or strobe systems or backdrops or stands and things like that really trying to to do it with the minimal amount of gear possible so i'm going to take you guys along and i'm going to show you what we're doing and how we do it hopefully maybe share some information teach you guys a couple of things and and answer some questions but in the meantime let's just have fun on our way into work Everybody wants to know, why do you why do you have a motorcycle when cars are so convenient? And then, there is some truth to that, cars are very convenient, but they're nowhere near this one. Come on. And we're going. I mean, doing 35 miles an hour, 40 miles an hour down this road, going to a couple of roundabouts and four-wheel four -wheel vehicle is pretty boring. You don't feel any of the air outside of you. There's no leaning. It's just, I don't know, boring. <laughs> this is so much more enjoyable. my day job at this point is not photography because we're building the business but uh, I'm fortunate enough to work for uh, somebody who allows me to work on these projects and stuff in my downtime 
so today, I'll show you how we're set up here. Just transporting an office is not always easy on a bike, but very simple. One messenger bag with a uh, carry-on pass-through. You know the type you can put on like your rolling luggage. A little loop in the back to hold on to the uh, handles. Just secured down with a couple of rock straps, which by far have been the most valuable thing ever when it comes to transporting things on a bike. What's really exciting is uh, how I figured out to transport not just a computer like today, but a computer, cameras, uh, drones, and a bunch of post-production equipment.